something called a magic square. Who here has heard of that before? Great, a few of you. Magic squares are generally done where the audience gives the performer a number from somewhere around 40 to 100. They then have to figure out, they then have to fill in the magic square with numbers to make it so every row and column add up to that number. However, I approach it a little differently. I have audience volunteers give me numbers to start with. Next, I have to figure out what number I can make the magic square add up to. Finally, I try to fill in the magic square before my show runs out of time. <laughs> let's get our volunteers. Instead of me choosing randomly, let's base it off of topics of interest. So you guys are all fans of science, right? Okay, I'm in seventh grade, and in school this year, we're actually studying biology. Who here likes biology? Okay, uh, you ma'am? Can you come on up? And while she's coming up here, even though I'm studying biology in school, my favorite area of science is astronomy. Who here likes astronomy? Okay, uh, you sir, come on up. And while he's coming up here, I need one more volunteer. So how about this? Who here is a fan of all of science in general? And, and how about you, ma'am? Could you help us out? So... Volunteers, a nice big round of applause. So, Lindsay, what I'm going to have you do is choose, is select any number from one to twenty, and put it in any square you would like. Go ahead. Great. And we come back, and you may be seated. And Al, you'll do the same thing as she did. Any number from 1 to 20, any one of the remaining 15 squares. You could even do the same number as she did, but you can't choose the same square. <laughs> Thank you. And you may be seated. And I'll have you do the same thing. Any number from 1 to 20, any one of the remaining 14 squares. and you can sit down also. At this point, I would like to mention that there are 4.48 million possible combinations of numbers and squares that they could have chosen. Scott, you can check that. And, <laughs> and it took me a really long time to memorize them all. <laughs> Let's see what we've got here. Was able to make it work. Let's take the first row. We have 0 plus 12 is 12, plus 18 is 30, 
plus 12 is 42. Let's, let's take the other ones. We have 12 plus 18 is 30, plus 2 is 32, plus 10 is 42, 7 plus 5 is 12, plus 7 is 19, plus 13 is 42, 23, 30, 35, 42. Let's try the column. 0 plus 12 is 12, plus 7 is 19, plus 23 is 42, 12 plus 18 is 30, plus 5 is 35, plus 7 is 42, 18, 20, 37, 42, 12, 22, 35, 42. How about that? Now, I decided to take things one step further. I actually decided to make the diagonals add up to 42 as well. 0, 18, 35, 42, 12, 14, 19, 42. But I didn't stop there either. I decided to make the middle box add up to 42 as well. Check it out. 18, 20, 25, 42. But did I stop there? No. No. I don't, I don't know if you noticed, but I paid a little extra attention to that corner right there. What I did is I allowed this box right here to add up to 42. 0, 12, 24, 42. I thought, let's have a party. Let's get this group of 4, 18, 30, 32, 42. This group of 4, 7, 12, 35, 42. This group of 4. 17, 30, 35, 42. But did I stop there? No. no. I got this group of four, 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 this group of four. In fact, there are 36 different ways that this magic square adds up to 42. But let me show you one more way the four corner numbers add up to 42. 0, 12, uh, 35, 42. And if you think about it, of course the magic square had to add up to 42 as it was started off by fans of biology, astronomy, and general science, the studies of life, the universe, and everything.